South Africa. No doubt you've been in your car and you've heard this. The Mervis family has been working at those diamond fields for generations. But you haven't heard this. You followed me? And then he said, I'll marry you. Masha Mervis's love story almost wasn't an entire life built on random chance. Meet the woman behind the man behind the D.C. area Diamond Empire. I have to get married. If I don't get married, I have to go back. It was before the war. He said, oh, yes, I'll, I'll, I'll marry you. I'll sign for you straight away. It started as a marriage of convenience. See, Masha had escaped her native Lithuania. It was 1938, right before World War II. She was on a six-month visa in South Africa. That's when she met up with Morris. They got married. Then they fell in love. A loving marriage, a loving family, and well provided. And it was a, a lifetime of joy. The two were married 67 years. Morris passed away in 2005. These are the hands that held three sons, seven grandchildren, ten great-grandchildren, and the hands that used to hold this ring. Morris gave it to her on her 50th wedding anniversary. This was a very sentimental ring for me. Wednesday, the ring was gone. I was in such a shock. The Mervis matriarch says she's recently been sick, her ring's loose. She says the diamond may have value to whoever found it, but it could never mean as much as it does to her. This is part of me and part of my husband, part of my life.